My science fair project is energy harvesting. I made an energy harvesting matrix. The energy harvesting matrix is made out of seven pelty tiles and copper and aluminum heat sinks on each side of the tile. The pelty Seebeck effect says that heat exchange through a thermal couple produces electricity. A, a pelty tile is a thermal couple. The copper heat sink uh, is on the hot side because copper is a better heat conductor than aluminum and aluminum is on the cold side. The energy harvesting matrix produces about 70 millivolts and 625 microamps. Then the input power goes to the to the energy harvesting device which increases the input power to 4.8 volts and 4.7 microamps. Then it stores it in the capacitor and the output power goes to the LED lights or to the iPhone charger. My procedure is I streamed a YouTube video, I marked down the time of the video and the 1% and the of charge decreased. I did that 15 times without the charger and 15 times with the charger. My conclusion is that I did not charge my iPhone completely, but I did increase the playing time of, to about 9 seconds per 1% of charge. Well, that's really nice, Lee. Um, that's really good work. Um, can you tell me a little bit more? Um, so why didn't you, um, why weren't you able to charge the phone completely? Because I did not have enough power. Our bodies only produce about 5 milliwatts of heat per square centimeter. This did not produce enough heat exchange through the energy harvesting matrix. That, that's really good. Um, so, um, so I'm going to um, come over there um, and get some shots of what you got there. Um, and you can tell me a little bit about um, your um, set up there on your board. Um, so these are the LED lights. This is the iPhone charger. This is the capacitor. And this is the energy, harvesti the energy harvesting device. Okay. The, there is a transformer on the energy harvesting device that that is a 1 to 100 ratio. That increases the input power to 20 to 5 volts. So it, it takes in as, as, mu as little as how much? 20 micro, uh, no, 20 millivolts. 20 millivolts, and how much can you get out of that thing? About 5 volts. 5 volts. And tell me what's over here. What's on this the next is, one? These are, the res these are resistors for the iPhone charger. Then this is the um, energy harvesting matrix. Oh, that's where the energy harvesting matrix is plugged in there. Okay, mm -hmm. that looks good. Um, so tell me again, so explain to me how this um, energy harvesting device, what is it doing in there? It's increasing the input power and it's, I think of it as a stoplight. It's letting one power go to the capacitor and some pow and power to the charger it, or the LED lights. LED lights, okay. And That's you, can, a, you can see the LED lights going, right? They're blinking, yep. right? This is ultraviolet and um, Let's see, just tell me what, what color lights do you have there? This, oh, I have it on the wrong one. This is white. Okay, move your hand so we can see. Oh, there it goes. It's blinking. Okay. And then... The next color is what? This color is blue. There's blue, yes. Then this color is green. Good. And this color is yellow. Okay, hold on. Let's see it. Oh, there you go. Yellow is pretty good. Good. This color is orange. Hold on, let's see. It didn't. Uh, oh, there we go. There's orange. Okay. And then this is red. Okay, Lily. Um, that was very good. Um, 
Thank you, Lily. Thank you.